smell. They don't smell. Tell the truth. You don't think those dogs smell? You know, some people happen to enjoy smell of dogs. They stink. Russ, Jerry, and Sid were three ordinary guys. To what do we owe this honor? I was in the neighborhood. I didn't hear any alarms going off. Don't start trouble. Who are you talking trouble? to? Desperate for their big break. You know all those old people that wait in front of the supermarkets? We start our own car service. This is a niche. And yeah, we found a niche. Are we lost? What's the problem? I'm taking a little detour. Okay? Oh. A little shortcut. Take me home. Why don't you just shut your mouth? I'm, I'm Mr. News. I think the whole thing's a little too servile. What? You understand? Too servile. Servile. Yes, yeah, servile. It sucks. You got a better idea? But when they took on a life of crime, I'm talking about a momentary shift in lifestyle. A little itty bitty alteration. They never realized it would be so much work. I don't believe this. This is next door. I know we're next door. Hurry up! You set up a jewelry store, then you rob a jewelry store. You don't rob a bakery. Hi. 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 Who is that, a friend of the dogs? The Samuel Goldwyn Company presents a comedy. She's good looking, good in bed. And she's crazy about you, am I right? What a predicament. About the thrill of it. We cannot rob an armored truck. If it's only armed robbery, if we carry guns. So what are we gonna do with mirrors? Toys. The lure of it. Come on, come on. Are you a thief? Why do I look like one? <laughs> and the art of getting it. Pass him. What? Any way you can. Oh, look at this. You're wearing masks for because we're gonna rob you. We're not cut out for this. Some people are, for instance, criminals. Palookaville, a momentary shift in lifestyle. 